Good work in Colorado, 47. I hope you've managed to get some sleep on your Trans-Pacific flight. I'm fine. As always. Well, as you've guessed, you're en route to Japan. We've intercepted a memo indicating that local authorities have detained a man suspected of carrying an infectious disease and shipped him off to a medical facility further north. Another cult operative. That has been confirmed, yes. But even better. We believe this man is the one responsible for the development of the virus itself. His last known whereabouts match the final set of coordinates set by Nabazov's dead man's trigger. It appears he was headed for Sydney, Australia, but his arrest put a stop to that. That was fortunate. Luck has little to do with it. Passengers noticed him performing some sort of religious ritual in the airport lounge and got nervous. Police detained him for further questioning when he started showing signs of illness. Standard protocols kicked in, and he's now en route to Hokkaido. The mission briefing will be available for review in a few moments. You have two targets. First, Owen Cage, the rogue viral researcher responsible for the weaponization of the Nabazov virus. Cage was moved to the Hokkaido Gamma facility by Japanese authorities. All evidence indicates that he infected himself, intending to become patient zero. He is currently being kept alive in isolation by your second target, Klaus Lieblied. An Ether Corporation scientist, Dr. Lieblied is trying to extract as much information about the virus as possible before Owen Cage dies. We cannot allow Ether to succeed in reverse engineering the virus and profiting from it. Your task is simple, 47. Contain the virus by eliminating Cage and Lieblied. Whatever happens, the Nabazov virus must be destroyed. We must contain it here, no matter the cost. I'll leave you to prepare. Hey, what's up, guys? So I'm going to do a commentary on this last Patient Zero board. It's the final level. Um, so this is going to be for the Silent Assassin and suit only. Uh, the Silent Assassin wasn't too too hard at all. But the suit only is a, is a pain in the ass because there's just so many people jammed into a tight spot. And from what I could tell, this board was patched a few times, so old videos might not work for you anymore. So this is the latest video. Um, so I'm going to grab that soda can. I'm going to use it in a minute. And right here, I'm just going to climb the ledge, climb down that pipe, and I'm going to go through the window underneath me. Uh, your yellow indicator might pop up here because the guards are patrolling. But they never seen me, so I, I want to worry about that. You just want to you you just want to be quick here. You don't want to be wasting time because you want to get to the uh, infected patient zero before he leaves his room. Because once he infects that one nurse in the hallway, it's a pain in the ass, and don't even bother after that. Just restart it. So right now I'm just waiting for uh, these guys to clear out of the room, and this might be the hardest part: is just not getting infected yourself. So you're gonna go in and you wanna skirt the room, you wanna be right at the edge. I'm gonna use this can and knock the dude out. Make sure it's locked on so you don't don't just throw it at the ground. And then right here, you wanna take out cage. And then once he's dead, you don't have to worry about getting infected anymore. So you can run into the room and be safe. And then we got this cabinet, you can just throw their bodies right here. And now for my method, it's real simple to do, but it just takes time because we just got a clear path to the next target and we're going to have to take out three of the guys in suits and then one guard. From what I could tell they added a guard to this level um, with a patch. So I'm going to save it after everybody I take out because I don't want to do everything over and over again. So this guy he's going into that bathroom. I'm going to lure him into the room with one coin. Once you get him in the room um, you want to throw another coin to get them deep, deep into the room, into that corner, so you don't, you know, miss your opportunity to choke them or have to risk running out and being seen. So you could either just do this, what I did, it's a little riskier, or you could just wait till he turns around and then run behind him and grab him as he's leaving the room. So to save some time, I'm just going to speed it up because he's got, I got to take out four dudes using this method. Like I said, it's just going to take a little longer, but I feel like this is this. I wanted to upload the simplest way, 
so that everybody could do it. And there's like no crazy timing you got to master and do a hundred times to try to figure it out. It's pretty simple and straightforward. So I'm going to do this. I got two guys. I'm going to get one more guy in the mop suit and then I'm going to grab a guard. And the, the guard's a pain in the ass. He's going to walk down the hallway. You just got to lure him in. You got to throw a coin into the hallway just to get him down to that room. You'll see. Uh, then after that, I'm going to get the main guy. It's not too hard. And we're just going to exit out the way we came. So I threw out in the hallway just to get him down. And then I'm now this is going to take three coins instead of two. Get him into the room and then now one deep into the corner. He's got to call call it in. So the coin is almost you know, your most important weapon for this method. Alright, so I'm stacking bodies. Alright, so now I'm ready to go. I cleared the path. Saved it. I'm going to go down here. There's going to be another guy in a suit, but he doesn't turn around from what I can. He never turned around for me. I just walk right past him. I'm going to go up here. See, for some orientation, that's the front door when we're coming in. I'm going to hack, hack the door, so make sure you bring that hacking device. If not, you could drag one of those guys in a suit, and then they, they'll open the door for you because their suit radiates the signal. So I kind of got a little too excited. I went into the room, but it kind of worked for me because it made him come out and investigate. I just couldn't grab him because he was facing me. He had an angle towards me. So I waited till he went back in, and I threw a coin. You couldn't see it, but I threw a coin in the corner there so that he was facing away from me. So I'm just going to choke him out and then break his neck. And then there's going to be another cabinet where he came from. You just got to take out another guy in here so he doesn't see you. So we'll throw a coin to make sure he's turned around. Be extra safe. And you got to watch to your right. That guy's going to be walking right there. Just wait till he turns before you go in. There's like a little, there's a little a couple seconds where he's facing that door. And he will see you. Let's choke him out. Drag him in here. And there's going to be a guy up here, but he, does, he doesn't turn around either, so you don't have to worry about him. Dump the body. And grab the other guy, dump the body. We're going to go out the same way we came in, through that window. And for my exit, I'm going to climb up the little mountainside, and I'm going to skirt that ledge. Um, you just got to worry about there's two guards up there. Um, you'll see what I do. You just be patient, and eventually they'll turn. And they'll face away from you and just run behind them, and then you can exit, and that's it. E easy, easy silent assassin suit only um, for a pretty tough uh, level. But that's it. Uh, if you have any questions, let me know in the comments. Thanks for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye. Very well done, 47. Owen Cage and Klaus Liebliet are both dead, and the Nabazov virus has no chance to spread. I've relayed the information to the board. They offer their congratulations. We'll speak again shortly.
I finished the final operations report for the client. And the weaponized virus? Destroyed. I supervised it. This was a close-run thing, 47. Nabazov's plan was brilliant. This is beyond the work of a cult. This is tradecraft. Indeed. Of course, as far as the ICA is concerned, the contract is closed. Sounds like you have some work ahead of you before I get involved. I have to go. I've acquired the target. I knew our nameless friend would come through.